Hey team, it is Monday. I'm going to go to the gym, have a quick workout, get a bit of a pump on and start fresh tomorrow with an early morning run. On 6.30 this morning, I feel absolutely whacked this week. I'm not feeling it. The struggle is real trying to get out of bed, <laughs> but we're going to go and run. It's like 6. Point, no, no, is it 7.6 miles, something like that. 7.6 miles this morning. Gonna go on my route on a trail and just, yeah, it's meant to be steady and it will be steady. I'm knackered. Oh, we'll get it done. Hello, hello. We are only about a mile in. Going up a hill. It's pitch black, as you can see. Um, oh. I did the gym last night and it's legs. And oh my God, that's even whack. But we're getting it done, at least it's not too hot. It is, what's the time now? It's 7.51 miles, it's eight o'clock. Just come back from 7.5 miles, so-called comfortable run. That was far from comfortable. That was bloody hard work, actually. I went to the gym last night and did legs and my, I am just cooked. I think I'm gonna have a day off this week just to recharge. <laughs> Hello team, quick update. I was meant to run 17 miles this morning and I, I've been knackered this week. So I'm having a quieter week this week. Early trains this morning at five o'clock and then maybe I'll do the run on the weekend at Saturday or Sunday, Saturday morning, early 7 a.m. But I'm gonna do a lot less miles this week and we'll get back on it next week. team i hope you're well it is saturday the 3rd of february today and as you'll probably know by now i have not done much running this week i ran once and i think i'll talk about that separately but today i thought you know what i looked at my runner plan and there's a run for tomorrow for sunday and it's like 6.9 miles on the travel mile. And I thought, you know what, I want to get back into it so I'm ready for next week. I thought I'd do the treadmill run and see how I feel, but I'll do the miles and I'm just going to ease back into it next week. And I'm actually quite looking forward to it now. So, going to the gym now to get it done should be good. And I've got a busy day. I'm very, it's good. Very, got some gels, got my water. Let's make it happen. I hope you're all having a fantastic weekend and I look forward to seeing you next week. just got back from the gym. It was very productive actually. I did, oh, what did I do? Ah, I know what I did. Okay, <laughs> I did, it was meant to be, I think it's like 6.9 miles, like four, three miles of 10.9 uh, miles an hour, 
which is quite quick. So you do one mile, have like six second rest, nine seconds, whatever it is, do it again, do it again. The first three miles were good. I did them fine. They were hard, don't get me wrong. I found it bloody challenging. And then it moved into like um, 0 0.5 miles, four of them again at a quicker pace. And then it, then you did four of them at uh, quicker again, then three, then another four, uh, even quicker pace, but half the distance. Probably messed all that up. But, but it essentially gets progressively harder over the, the duration of the activity. And I thought it was solid. So what I did was I did the speed that they said, but on the last three miles, I reduced the mileage at the speed. So I thought I'm still feeling a bit not have full energy so but i really want to get back into it so i've done most of the workout bang on the last three i've reduced and to me i feel quite happy with that it was still bloody hard work and but i'm happy i'm glad i'm back into it and uh looking forward to uh next week <laughs> I thought I would give you an update on my runner training plan and where I am currently and what really happened this week. How did it go off the rails? Monday, I obviously did an easy run. Fantastic, loved it. Because you can walk and run, it's vibes. Set me up well. Was, mind you, I was absolutely exhausted. And as you can see, I only ran at like 10 minute miles. It's like slow for me. I was just smoked. I, and I, I realized that I was absolutely burnt out this week, like truly burnt out, just exhausted at every level. So I thought, having had it previously once before, it's like learning from experience, take it to stop, to stop doing, take it really easy, have some rest days, and then get back to it when you, when you feel better, like next week. And so I haven't done anything all week. And to be honest, I've really felt my battery recharge, got so much more energy, brilliant vibes again. So today, I thought, you know what, I'll do one of the runner plans this week, which is like a progressive run that was meant to be on Sunday, but it's Saturday today. I'll do it today because I feel good. And I'll just start the activity. And if, if I can't do it all to, this, to the time, you know, the speeds and stuff, it's not the end of the world. At least I'm back into it and I'll do the distance and I'll just jog it out. But it actually worked out quite well today and I feel good. I think it's important to note too, if you do ever feel like this, take the time out to um you know rest recoup get yourself back into it normally when i do events but previously like iron man's running i've never really followed a plan and don't get me wrong i'm loving this plan it's actually making my life easier but it's really hard especially if you've got a busy life getting into it you you feel so obliged to hit the miles each day because it's like daily like do this tomorrow do that wednesday it's it's just relentless. Don't get it wrong, it's good. But previously, how I've done it before is I just sort of go on how I feel. And if I think I'm like, oh, feeling a bit knackered, really burnt out this week, I'll just won't go tomorrow. And it sort of, I like ride the waves of how I feel, which has done me well previously. Obviously, following a plan, it's not quite the same as that. But um, I feel really good for taking a few days off and I'm really looking forward to getting back into the, uh, the plan and getting the speed back up and getting it done because it's not long till Paris I'm very much excited so I hope you're all um I thought we'd give you an honest review this week I didn't want you to think that I was just smashing my plan because I am not I have been up to, to to a degree but absolutely went off the rails this week so yeah if um if any of you would be interested to anyone else feels the same when they're training with something where their life gets in the way and they feel really burnt out you know drop a comment I'd love to hear what you all do do you take a few days off or do you persevere and power through